a lot of people want to know if nfts are dead and if it's even worth investing into nfts so in today's short and sweet video welcome back to another video my name is rafa aka the crypto network um be sure to join the crypto network community discord from the description below if you have not already and if you want to support me further you can join the vip club um today's video like i said nfts short and sweet probably won't probably won't even be more than five minutes just to explain to you guys nfts in general without getting too much in depth nfts were a hype train in a sense it kind of exploded early last year throughout the period of all last year and even early this year right as we saw bitcoin tank nfts were also tanking now if you guys don't know you can always check out nfts on coin market cap as well which nft cryptos are doing good we saw the hype of decentraland sandbox you know apecoin gala a lot of these projects that were doing okay right we also have nfts such as crypto punks that still survived board ab yacht club that still survived mutant ab yacht club that still survived but again, if you go and look at the prices of these projects and check out the average prices and see how, what they've, how they've been performing in the last couple of months, they've all been taking a huge hit. Not to mention that Ethereum itself has also gone by, gone down from 4,000, let's not forget 4,500 area to 1,300. So even something like CryptoPunks that's worth 600, you know, the volume is 622.8 ETH. And it doesn't say the floor price price here, but the average price is 77.85 ETH. You know, this one from something like 75 Ethereum multiplied by 1,500. One of these NFTs is worth an average of $100,000, right? Whereas now if Ethereum was $4,000, then it would be worth even more. So a lot of these projects have taken a tank. Now, I think this video might offend you if you're an NFT lover, but one thing that you need to know is bitcoin is everything bitcoin is the leading factor of all prices when meme coins were you know in motion if bitcoin was up and exploded meme coins were also exploding it doesn't matter what meme coin it was they were exploding when bitcoin was going up doge and shiba was going up when bitcoin was going up ethereum was going up bnb was going up right so in bull rallies and bull runs, everything goes up. It's not hard to make a lot of money in a bull run. And I've made videos about what you can do and what you can't do and what you should be looking for and what you shouldn't be looking for. So be sure to watch all the other videos too. But the most transparent answer I can give you is it might be cool to have an NFT. They might have some use cases that are kind of effective me personally this is just my opinion i think the only real like utility nfts even those it takes a lot of interest to get involved back into nfts i mean think about it right why do you want to invest in nfts if the whole crypto market is di dying when crypto was up everything was up so it's like it's kind of like you don't want to talk about something that's consistently affecting your mental health or has affected your mental health or affected your financial situations so nfts 90 percent of them won't survive and that's the truth compare the top nft collections today you know check the prices out compare them to what they were last time you know nfts were in the going up compare them to the last bull run which nfts were in the top collections it's the same thing nfts have very strict use cases the very strict circumstances where they can explode you know hype trains is definitely a huge part of it i'm not saying the nfts are dead i'm not saying nfts will be useless forever you know they're not useless today but 90 percent of them won't stay so when you're looking for an nft make sure they're backed by massive companies make sure they have insane liquidity capital make sure they have insane venture capitalists and you know just backing them up because crypto punks board ape yacht club right azuki some of these you know i mean board ape 
is in the top of, like there's like three of their projects that are up here so i don't even i've never even heard of other deed for other side so in general these nfts have only survived because <laughs> they have so much capital to keep the movement going so much community involvement so much engagement now the truth is like i said <laughs> You're not going to make a lot of money from NFTs right now. You could buy some of the ones that are like, look at these, right? You'd have to spend a ton of money, like minimum $10,000, $5,000. If you ever really want to make any sort of profit, right? Tomorrow bull run comes back. Maybe you'll two, three X these NFTs, but it's really a hit or miss during a bear market. It's very hit or miss during a bull run. Because some NFTs might go up higher than the other ones and you might have FOMO. You might sell one to flip the other. And then when you flip the other one, some venture capital invested. Do you guys remember when Web 3.0 and NFT and all these companies were looking for NFT developers and NFT artists? Well, those people are getting fired now. So I always come back to this idea and there's nothing is guaranteed in crypto. So if you're going to be safe, if you want to stay safe, invest in the big things. Invest into, you know, cryptocurrencies first before you're looking at NFTs. NFTs got a lot of the younger generation involved. And many of you guys who are watching this video might have been involved because of TikTok. But again, there is just so much concrete things that need, like so many dominoes need to fall for your NFT to do well. And that's the truth, okay? Even something as uh, I've been looking at, online and i'm not paid to talk about this is logan paul came up with this collection called 99 originals and even though it's such an amazing project it's such a creative unique thing that he did for himself and his artistic mindset and he put a lot you if you watch the video on youtube he put so much effort into it right but if he had released it on time during a bull run it would have been a multi 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 million dollar you know overall project and the NFT could possibly have been in the top 10, top 20. But again, because, you know, right idea, wrong time, it didn't happen. It's it's not, no one really talks about it that much unless you really go and look into it. It's like, oh yeah, he does that thing. You know, you see it on TikTok and he shows the videos. He put in so much effort into it. It's a great, outstanding project and it actually has, like, serves an, like, some sort of purpose like if you own some of the things he has a liquid marketplace as well and again i'm not paid to talk about this i'm just saying there's so many creative ideas during uh when it when it comes to the nft space so you just have to genuinely be patient if you're going to get invested into it and these are things that you need to listen to things that you need to hear before you step foot in the nft world my name is rafa aka the crypto network i will see you guys in the next video peace